When my husband and I were first told that our twins had autism, it turned our world upside down. I knew it was my purpose in life to be their mum, but this really made me just want to be the best mum I could be for them. I've got so many hopes and dreams for our children. I want them to make friends at school. I want them to build relationships when they're older, maybe even get married and have their own little families one day. Most of all, I just want them to be happy and I want them to live in a world that is more understanding about autism. Just like anyone else, people on the spectrum have their own hopes, dreams and visions for their futures and these can be big or small. One of my dreams, and I've had this ever since I was very young, is that I'd one day like to become a journalist. Me and a friend have already discussed this. We want to build a book on bird identification, moles and sex things for every single bird in the UK. I just want to be remembered. The favourite thing I've always wanted to be throughout my future, throughout my time, is to be a DJ. Probably going to get a place in Britain's Got Talent 2018. My dream is to be a comedian. I'd like to be where I'm where I've got no, no angst, no upset. I hope to show the world that just because you're autistic doesn't mean you can't achieve things out of life. But many people with autism aren't able to articulate their hopes and dreams. They can't even express how they're feeling and this can lead to meltdowns. One charity has a unique vision on how to change this for the better. I'll let them explain some more. Our vision at Autism Together is that biometric wristbands should be the key to supporting people with complex autism. Imagine that you're autistic and you're becoming distressed and anxious with what's going on around you, but because of your autism, you can't tell anyone. What would you do? Well, it'd be frustrating for a start and you may become aggressive, you may want to shout and scream, you may even want to hurt yourself, and these behaviours are called meltdowns. But if you're wearing one of these, it'll be recording your biological signs, things like heart rate, skin temperature, and perspiration. All that information will be sent to the mobile device of your carer to help them understand what's causing you to become stressed and to help them to support you to reduce those distressing meltdown behaviors. This whole building has served us well for nearly 50 years, but now we're hoping to replace the whole building with a high-tech and autism-friendly center where biometric technology will be used every single day to help autism professionals assess understand and treat people with complex autism. Over one in every 100 people now have the condition in the UK. That's 600,000 individuals. We can't ignore that figure. It's about time we started thinking about the future, about their future. Our vision is that right here in the Northwest, we will create a world leading center that will understand the needs of autistic people better than ever before. This pioneering project can only happen with your help. Please make Autism Together's vision a reality by donating to the Future 50 appeal. Here's how to donate.